I walk around and I can be related to anyone. I dread every new match that comes, but they just keep coming. I know deep down that we will never, ever know the complete truth as to how many siblings we have. Genetic tests reveal all. I was 35 and I take a DNA test. Up in ancestry. I had over 3,000 hints. I think one of the scariest things is that the, the potential for unknown siblings to kind of hook up. We're um, matching as close relatives on ancestry and um, somehow mentioned the name Klein. This was a person of a position of power. He's known in our community as a philanthropist. He's an elder of the church. I know that nothing happens without God allowing it. One of my favorite scriptures was Jeremiah 1.5. Before I formed you in your mother's womb, I knew you. We were told that they were going to be residents from interns at the hospital across the street and that our payment of cash or check was to protect the anonymity of that person. Think about all the hundreds and thousands of women he lied to about the source of the sperm. Klein's attorney appeared before the state medical license board today on the retired doctor's behalf, and now he no longer has a legal right to practice medicine here in the state of Indiana. The 79-year-old pled guilty today to two counts of obstruction of justice. Prosecutors filed those charges after Klein lied to the attorney general about using his own sperm to impregnate his patients. Klein told the court during his sentencing that he was sorry, saying, quote, out of fear, I acted alone and foolishly I lied. The House committee is now is expected to amend and vote on a bill combating fertility fraud next week. This is a bill that's a direct result of Dr. Donald Klein.